When Lexus announced that the IS was going to be refreshed for 2021, I was super happy. And today I finally got to check it out. What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of JDM for All. If you haven't already, please do not forget to like and subscribe. Today I was lucky enough to check out the new Lexus IS and it is amazing. I also got to check out a few other Lexus products including this GSF which is an amazing V8 and look at this car, it's just stunning. But not only that, I also got to enjoy some awesome Lexus cookies, yes. The new IS has a lower, wider look than it ever had before, and I must say, it looks very aggressive. This vehicle's exterior has had major changes compared to the last generation. There have been many changes to the exterior of this car, and there are a few that I'm going to point out in this video because they really caught my eye and I'm really liking this. One of the things that I've noticed about the front end is that the headlights are slightly different. They look really good. And the daytime running lights were moved from the bottom of the headlight to the top of the headlight. The daytime running lights were not attached to the headlights before, but now they are and they look great. And another detail that I noticed that I really like is that the daytime running light kind of carves into the front bumper and it really looks good. The front end of this car looks very aggressive, as does the rest of this vehicle. The hood has a lot of interesting lines, including these two lines I did not notice until now, and they look very cool and a little different from anything I've seen on the IS before. A lot of this car looks very cool and a little aftermarket, including these mirrors, which have gloss black finish, and it looks like there's an integrated blinker in the mirror, but instead of being at the bottom like it usually was, it's in the middle, cutting through the middle of the mirror, which is really cool. From what I saw, the interior has changed, but not as drastically as the exterior has. Something else that I noticed that a lot of people might not is that this car actually comes with a side splitter stock from the factory, which is really cool. A lot of people install these after they get their vehicles just to make their cars a little bit different, but now the IS comes with them from the factory. about this new IS, you've probably heard about these tail lights, which are basically a brand new idea. A lot of cars are starting to get these now. We're starting to see them all over the place. And basically tail lights that go across the whole back of the vehicle are starting to become a big trend. But these tail lights look amazing. And not only that, the diffuser on the back of this car looks really cool. A lot of people put these on aftermarket wise, but this car comes with an awesome diffuser. Thank you. 